Yo, what's up, everybody? It's Marquis, the coolest nerd, coolestnerd.net. Uh, back with another quick unboxing. Uh, this is a very special unboxing. I actually don't remember the last time I did an unboxing. Uh, hmm. Hasn't been anything to unbox lately. So, this is going to be uh, something fresh. Something really, really fresh. I, got, I know I got some new unboxings coming up soon, so... Wait on that, but we're going to get into this one. And, uh, yeah, yeah, I, yeah, I got one. Yeah, I did. Uh, this is the 500 million limited edition PlayStation 4 Pro. Yeah, yeah, one of 50,000. So, uh, yeah, I was lucky enough to get one and, um, actually did get the, uh, headset as well and uh, this little bad boy right here a little extra controller so uh yeah got all of it um I, you know the plan was really to get to, to sell it man you know I, you know well if the right offer came up but um i think i've decided to keep it um you know i'm an avid PlayStation player and just a lover of all things PlayStation, really. So uh, it's hard to let go of, man. And I feel like for what people are paying for it out there, I, I don't feel like it's worth giving up for that amount. I mean, it's worth more to me than that. So, so yeah. So anyway, let's get into this unboxing, man. Um, I mean, y'all probably seen unboxings from a lot of other places. I know people got it early. You know, the bigger websites, bigger streamers, whatever. Uh, but you got the different kind of packaging. So it's like, you know, a plastic, uh, type feel kind of like the, uh, the covers that come over the steel cases, the steel book cases, kind of like that, but maybe a little thicker. Um, de well, definitely a little thicker, uh, but the, it feels like the entire case is made of this. So it's like clear. So what you're seeing here, the actual, you know, you can see the bronze logo through it. Um, that is the actual PlayStation that you're seeing. So, definitely different from the regular box. Um, and you can see right here where it has the 500 million limited edition right there. Two terabytes, of course. Which I already have two terabytes in my current Pro, but, uh, you know, I'm going to replace it. So, that's it's good that it has the two terabytes. That way I don't have to switch out the hard drives. I can just transfer everything via Ethernet. So, pops open from the bottom. So we're gonna lift this up. What? Weird, weird smell. Don't smell like new shoes. I don't know what that is. Something like polyurethane or something. Um, but kind of tilt this up. Well, I guess after you take it out of this casing, I mean, that's it. That's, that's it. You know, so definitely hold on to that though. Uh, here it is in the box. So it's got the little cloth cover over the top with the the bronze thing. So I thought it was, a, I mean, I should have known better. Of course, that's the PlayStation, but it's a cloth over the top of it, protecting it. Um, yeah, so nothing on the back. It's just open like that. So, okay, a little magnetic, a little flat right here. And uh, upon opening, you can see the camera and the controller. So I'll pull the controller out. I don't know if I'm going to use my other one. Um, I may just keep it in the box, you know, keep it on ice. Whew. Mm. Ah, boy. Whew. This, this might be the best controller I've ever seen. Oh my gosh. Like, it's one thing to see an unboxing, but to see this in person is, it's crazy. Like, you, you really almost feel like you don't want to use this. Just looking at it is, this is amazing. Man, I don't know if y'all can capture the, 
if the camera can capture the beauty of this thing for real it's it's like a frost like a ice blue on the emblems on the buttons and then the actual analogs are are like a dark blue as well i mean everything's basically dark blue on it except for the bronze the only thing that's black is the touchpad everything is blue it wow wow that's crazy Alright, so I don't want to make this unboxing too long, so let me stop. Um, so we got the camera. The camera's just the camera, man. I mean, you know, it's the one that comes in the new VRs. So it's the rounded one. Um, we'll pop it out of the bag. I'm going to take it out anyway. So we got the camera, and it's just dark blue. You know what I mean? It's that, that navy, like everything else. So that's sweet. It'll replace my other one. Throw that back in the bag. I don't know why, man. I just ain't ready to really keep it out like that yet. I just got it today, by the way. Maybe like an hour ago. All right. So, so I'm going to go back down in there. Uh, this is something. Uh, you know, typical stuff. Instructions and whatnot. Stuff that people that play video games don't really need. Um, and then I would imagine that these are the cords. Okay. At the bottom of this whole thing is the actual translucent stand. I've never had a vertical stand for a PlayStation. For any of them, I don't think. I remember I used to tilt my original PlayStation on the side for the disc to run after it got a little old. But, uh, in the PlayStation 2, I think it was built to be vertical without a stand. So... The three, uh, the fat one I probably turned up on its side, but the smaller ones I, I never had to do that. But uh, yeah, you can see this is the vertical stand. It's translucent. It's like a you know clear coat. I think it's more translucent than the rest of the stuff. It's more like a crystal type with a little blue faded in. I don't. Think I'm gonna use it because where my PlayStation is is not really a place where you would stand it up. I, I don't even know. It probably could. Might 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 do it. I don't know. Uh this yeah, I think this has to be like the power cord and HDMI. Yeah, it is. So power cord, HDMI, and the little oh yeah, the little headset that comes in there is translucent blue too. So the little earpiece joint. Probably sell this to somebody for 20 bucks. Um, because you definitely can't get these if you don't have the console, so this is not something that you can just find in the store. The controller and the uh gold wireless headset is coming to stores early September, from what I heard. So people will probably be able to get their hands on those, you know, until they run out. Kind of like the 20th anniversary edition did, got the charging cable. And you got the mount for the uh, for the camera, and it's blue, of course, as well. All right, so all that cool, 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 cool. All right, so we're gonna get to the meat, get to the the main event right here. Losing my headset, which I will never use this thing. Falls out again. All right, so well, I'm just gonna take it out. So we're gonna pop this bad boy out of here. So the phone comes out with it, which is wrapped in this blue. Back down in there. Definitely did give a presentation on this man. So again. Got it in my hands, in the cloth. Mm -mm -mm. All right. Slide that off. And the whole thing is actually wrapped in plastic. The entire thing is wrapped in plastic. So that is... I, you almost want to keep it in the plastic, but of course you can't because it'll probably blow up or something. Because it's covering up the fans. Whew, boy. So 
this is, I'm not going to take the plastic off right now. I'm sorry, man. It's not going to do it. So, this is it. You can kind of see the bronze PlayStation symbol in the middle. And you can definitely see through this thing. I mean, you can definitely see through it. It's translucent for those that don't know. And you can definitely see all the components. It's sick. I've really never seen anything like it. Besides maybe a computer tower. You can see the back. Mm -mm -mm. And then the bottom, of course, uh, has the bronze PlayStation symbol as well, and it has the uh, you know the button emblem, so the X square triangle and O or circle, whatever. So it's on the. I don't know if it's on the bottom of the regular pros. I have to look at that and see. I'm not really sure. Um, yeah, this is crazy. So my number. Because this is a big thing. Obviously, all of them are numbered. Um, because there's only 50,000 of them. And I was hoping to get one of the, you know, the date of the release of the first PlayStation and stuff like that. Those are going to be extra special. But um, my number is 37958. So 37,958 um, out of 50,000. So that is pretty awesome. I've had a couple things in my life that were numbered like that but nothing quite like this so this is my little piece of history right here so yeah man that is the the playstation pro of all playstation pros right there i'm going to set this down very carefully oh all righty so we've already seen the controller so i'm not gonna pull that out but i will pull out the headset because um, you haven't seen it yet, so why not, right? So let's see what we got here. Typical box for a headset. Very simple packaging, nothing crazy. Um, for this, I haven't had a go wireless headset, not the new one, so it's probably, the other one's probably like this too. Got the dongle, got the 3.5 millimeter jack, go to the controller, got the charger cable. Um, just on the side right there. And then the headset itself, it's just sitting in there, man. Just waiting to be pulled out. And it's got the, the leather, blue, and then the translucent sides, man, with the bronze, copper, copper, I guess, emblem. Looking just as comfortable as ever. I have a platinum wireless headset. I'm not really sure what I want to do yet, man. I kind of feel like I might just pass that down to my son and uh, and rock this gold joint. So I might do that. I don't think it's going to make a difference one way or the other. But uh, yeah, got it. I don't think it, yeah, it actually has the, the PS, the PlayStation emblem on both sides in that bronze. So yeah, man. Really, really nice. Definitely a nice touch. You know, I was in the Navy, so I like the Navy blue, man. I'm all about some blue. Even though my favorite color is gray. Translucent. Feel like a crystal PlayStation. It's a straight crystal. Ooh, that would have been ill. But I like this, though. If, if there was anything better or just as good, this is it. So, anyway, that's it, man. PlayStation 4 Pro. 500 million, limited edition, one of 50,000. And it's mine with the headset and the extra controller. I'm happy, man. I hope y'all happy. Continue to check me out on YouTube and Twitch, the underscore coolest underscore nerd, and Instagram and Twitter at the nerd is cool. And of course, the coolest nerd.net, man. Do not forget. Check out the calendar on there, man. We got a lot of new release dates from Gamescom. It's going to be crazy, man, beginning of next year. If y'all don't know, go check it out. Till next time, shut up and play.